now, what does it take for a virus to cause a pandemic? You have to have a virus that is novel, that infects humans and causes disease. The population has to be susceptible. The way we usually think about it, it means that you don't have antibodies to that subtype. But very importantly, the virus has to be able to spread efficiently from person to person through sustained chains of community transmission. This is generally what public health experts are on the lookout for and why monitoring this virus is really important. So what the H5N1 viruses have are that they're novel, they infect people, they cause disease, and the population is susceptible, but they have not yet demonstrated the ability to spread efficiently from person to person. If this virus starts spreading between humans, then our problems have extended beyond dead birds and egg prices.